in the kitchen. Proudly brought to you by Chef Inox, the professional's choice, and Tablecraft. We welcome back Italian crooner Alfio, who spent two months overseas late last year and has been working on his album ever since. And he can cook too. Look, I try my best. Today, thank you very much for having me, Susie. Today we're doing uh, Primavera in Bianco, which means there's nice fresh vegetables in uh, white pasta sauce, some garlic, olive oil, some fresh tomatoes, some nice zucchinis, some, uh, what's this thing called here? Uh, uh, eggplant. Eggplant. Now these I put them in the microwave for a little bit just to, just to make things a bit quicker. Yeah. I'd usually throw them in. Throw first the eggplant, which is this one here. Because that takes the longest to cook, Takes the longest to cook, and you want that nice and... Oh nice and cooked. You don't want it to be. Well, there's nothing worse no. than, than undercooked um, eggplant for sure, for sure. So we're already at that stage, right? And so you put onion and chilli in there first. Now what I've done, it? I've got some finely chopped onions. Mm -hmm. I've got some uh, fresh chilli, which is this one over here. See so that? It's fresh oh. chilli. And um, I've put the onion in. Lots of olive oil, extra extra virgin olive oil. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I put some salt. Uh, let that cook. Let it. Let this is the, this is the secret to make the base is, is to make the onions nice and not not too fried. So I noticed you were doing that before. You were putting a little bit of water in, in the, with with your oil. With the oil on the onion. That's so it doesn't burn. Yeah, true I, story. Did you know that? I learned I learned something new. Now listen, while that is cooking, there's yeah. so much I do want to talk to you about because when you were overseas for two months, you just I think you met everyone who was anybody, didn't you? Almost. Now tell Almost. us about that. I went over there for the prim primary reason I went there was to sing for the National Italian American Foundation. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put some salt in this, two seconds. Um, which is the a very large organisation which which honours and, and recognises the work of Italian Americans in America. Well, they've been there for a lot longer than Italians have been in Australia. So, um, I mean, anyone who's anyone in the Italian film industry, uh, you know, there's been well, film industry. Martin Scorsese. Martin Scorsese was there. I mean, previous years you've had Marlon Brando. You know, in the early days, Frank yeah. Sinatra was there, honoured. You know, uh, Pavarotti was there to, in, uh, at his birthday actually, about four years ago. Bocelli was there last year. I was there this year. And last this year, year, I think it was great. Uh, Laura Bush, uh, Laura the, Bush the was first there. First lady. First lady. Nancy Pelosi was there. Rita Giuliani. Who else was there? Now, Rudy G... Uh, G uh, G well, I can't pronounce his last Giuliani. name. Giuliani. Giuliani, thank you. <laughs> he, of course, was the mayor of New York, wasn't he? That's right, he? yeah. And he was running for president. And I was actually meant oh. to go back over there and sing for Mr. Giuliani, but yes. then he sort of stepped out of the race, so... Mm. Yeah. And from Grey's Anatomy, you met um, uh, um, Ellen, Ellen Pompeo. Pompeo. Yeah. I wasn't sure how to pronounce her last name. Is she as as wafer thin as she looks she's, on television? She's, she's not. She's not as gorgeous as you, Susie, oh. but she's a lovely looking lady. <laughs> yeah. I think she's sensational, but I know what you mean. And okay, so who this else? Is, this oh, is sorry. Uh, sorry. I'm sorry to interject. No, this not is at all. almost we didn't ready. We to talk, didn't we? <laughs> oh, it's almost ready. Almost ready. It doesn't take too long. No. So once that's put the heat down a little bit more. Why don't I just turn that uh, and we can have a little bit of a closer look at that. Now I've deliberately left the garlic out to last because you want to taste the garlic. If you fry the garlic with the onions it becomes burnt and you don't taste the garlic. You ah. put the garlic in last like this, not too, as much as you want. You put as much as you want. You like can't garlic, have, you put more. Can't have too much garlic. Too much garlic. And now you start to smell the real smell of the nice garlic which is going to be cooking in there not lovely nicely and for you you're uh, your nona i can my nona. can you smell can you smell that can you smell it at home unfortunately we don't have smell a vision <laughs> it might come <laughs> it'd be good wouldn't it very nice although now, sometimes it would be good <laughs> now that's for later pass this for later mm -hmm. now the salt I put enough salt the fresh chilies i put in the in the with the onions yep. frying now i'm just going to add some lovely fresh tomatoes are they Roma tomatoes? They're, they're actually, look, have a look over here. Can we get the camera over here, please? They're these lovely oh, off, the, off, off the stem. See? Oh, that one fell off. <laughs> anyway, there's one with the stem on it. There you go. <laughs> so that's that. And this, now we don't want to cook the tomatoes too much. No. We want them there just as a feature, not mm -hmm. to make a sauce. If you leave them too long, they'll turn into a sauce, you know? Mm -hmm. So I think that's just about ready. Stuff. You've already pre-done the pasta. Pre-done the pasta. Now let me tell you about the pasta. When you cook them pasta, when I'm cooking pasta, which is almost every day, being Italian, always add some salt and some olive oil in the pasta. Mm -hmm. That's ready to go. Switch that off. Um, and that's been sitting there for a little bit, so it's looking a little bit 
a bit sorry, but we'll put some more olive oil on that. Mm -hmm. and <laughs> so put that like that. Okay. Now all we do, we add them together like this. Are you ready? Are you ready? We're going to add it together now. How are you going to put that in there? Yeah, in there. Is that too much Probably pasta? Probably too much pasta. Let's take some pasta out, shall we? Let's put some <laughs> pasta in here. I've cooked enough for everybody. Everyone's we got love to eat. That. You know, Italians cook uh, for everybody, not just so for you don't. You wouldn't put the pasta in there and swish it round? No. Oh. Unless you want me to. No, no, no. I'm just... I was simply asking the question. Okay, let's do that again. We're going to put the pasta in there and swish it around just like this. Look, look at that. Put the pasta in there. And we're going to swish it around. That's a good That's idea, actually. Then. No, you like did a bit idea? more. Yeah, oh, it's a good idea. But I had something else in mind, but now you've changed. This is, is a work in progress. <laughs> <laughs> but listen, I can tell you it's going to be very tasty. Okay, very okay, tasty. If the smell's got anything to do with it, <laughs> it will faster. be terrific. You're going to come back for us at the end of the show and sing. I will, I will, What I are will. you singing for? Uh, a song called Buona Sera, Signorina, Buona Sera. It is time to say goodnight to Napoli. Oh. Okay, now before you go. Yes. Before you serve this up, you put some of this nice fresh parsley in there, which is finely chopped. Well, right. while, while you're doing that, mix it up. Let me let me show everyone what's coming up now, and then we'll come back in the break. No, but I want the crew to taste it and we'll <laughs> okay. taste it up because I don't want you to rush. All right? <laughs> okay. uh, <laughs> no rush. No rush. Check this out. It's <laughs> awesome. It's called box tidy. Here now to close the show, Italian heartthrob himself. I've been uh, hugging him all this time, Alfio to sing for us. Take it away. Thank, Thank you. You take care. Bye for now. Buonasera, signorina. Buonasera. It is time to say goodnight to Napoli. Though it's hard for us to whisper Buonasera with that old moon above the Mediterranean Sea. In the morning, Signorina will go walking Where the mountains help the sun come into sight And by that little jewelry shop we'll stop and linger While I buy a wedding ring for your finger In the meantime, let me tell you that I love you Buonasera, Signorina, kiss me goodnight Buonasera signorina, kiss me goodnight Buonasera signorina, buonasera It is time to say goodnight to Napoli Though it's hard for us to whisper Buonasera With that old moon above the Mediterranean Sea Oh, signorina, in the morning we'll go walking Where the mountains help the sun come into sight And by that little jewelry shop we'll stop and linger As I buy a wedding ring for your finger In the meantime, let me tell you that I love you Oh, buonasera, signorina, kiss me goodnight and linger while I buy a wedding ring for your finger in the meantime let me tell you that I love you buonasera signorina kiss me goodnight buonasera signorina kiss me goodnight buonasera signorina kiss me